here's what it comes with a little holder pouch and the discs themselves one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and two men mandel holders are included I'm going to uh, set this up and test it on a Dremel tool for you so it's pretty easy to set up you have the disc and it has the diamond material it has a little offset on each side there then you have the included mandal I'm going to unscrew the uh, top part here and it looks like there's a floating washer on there which is good insert it through the, the hole and then turn it clockwise to get it back into the screw looks like it might be a 440 thread and then tighten it okay so I have a uh, Dremel tool here with a very slim tapered drive and you can see I have the tool mounted on there. I'm going to test it right now on a piece of wood. So as you can see, it works nicely, it's not hot, and has a lot of strength, so I was able to go through sideways. What I don't like about this is the diameter of this is relatively small, so you have a harder time getting any real depth. And if you look at a typical Dremel cutoff wheel, you look at the diameter of that, you can clearly see the difference in the diameter so that makes a big difference in the ability to reach while you're working on a project so um, I think they need to make the diameter of this at least to match the Dremel tool diameter uh, to, be, to be a competitive product the uh, Dremel Looks like it's about uh, seven eighths of an inch, and this tool is just a little over half of an inch in diameter. So I like this product from overall impression. It's going to last a lot longer than these. These crack pretty easily, but I'm concerned about that reach because it's a smaller diameter. So I'm going to give this product a four star rating on my review channel and I hope this video review helped you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.